Charlie Harper once said, a flock of flirting flamingos is pure passionate pink pandemonium. A frantic flamingo mangle, a discordant discotheque of delirious dancing flamboyant feathers and flamingo lingo. Now, you know why he only said it once. That said, in today's episode of Unusual As Usual, we're learning about the black flamingo. A rare black greater flamingo has been spotted among a flock of white and pink flamingos, and it's thought to be the only one in the world. This rare flamingo was spotted in Israel in 2013. Flamingos are usually born with white or grey feathers, however, as they grow their feathers begin to turn pink. The change in colour is due to the food that they eat. The flamingo's feathers, legs and face are coloured by their diet, which is rich in a natural pink dye called canthisanthin, coming from the brine shrimp and algae which make up the majority of their diet. However, in the case of the black flamingo, it's likely its unusual plumage comes from a genetic condition called melanism. Melanism is an overdevelopment of a dominant gene that causes hyperpigmentation, making the flamingo mostly jet black, including its feathers, legs and internal organs. Pentelis Cherry Lau, head of the environmental department of the British Sovereign Bases, said, a melanistic individual is a very, very rare sighting. Basically, it's the opposite of an albino when the individual produces more melanin than normal. Melanism has been observed in other animals such as roosters and panthers. In the case of crocodiles, melanism is actually a benefit because black is a poor light reflector, meaning their bodies retain heat much better. It can also help birds blend into their surroundings, making it a useful anti-predator defense for some species. But since adult flamingos don't have any natural predators, it could be its downfall. The downside is that too much pigment makes feathers in particular very brittle and prone to breaking. In 2015, a black flamingo was spotted for a second time, this time at a salt lake at the Akrotiri Environmental Centre on the southern coast of Cyprus. Flamingos can migrate huge distances, so it's very likely that it is the same bird. And there we have it, the black flamingo. Who says you have to be colourful to stand out? But how about you? Have you seen anything like the black flamingo before? Let me know in the comment section below and as always, don't forget to like and subscribe. That's all we've got time for today, but I'll see you all next week and remember, stay unusual as usual. If you've enjoyed this video, you might like this one too. If you want to see more abnormal animals, you can check out the full playlist by clicking here. Don't forget to ring that bell to make sure you don't miss out on next week's video and if you have any ideas on what the next episode should be about make sure you add it to the comment section below.